before I dive into this review, I just want to give a big shout out to my buddy Jason at PFAM5 here on YouTube. Make sure that you guys go and check him out. They go on adventures, and recently I've seen that they've been reviewing coffee. I did a Big B review, and in response, Dave did a Big B review and shouted me out, and it's greatly appreciated, so I just want to return the love to you guys. So God bless you. Hopefully, life is treating you well, and get out there and live life to the fullest. Thank you for rocking with me, man. Now, let's get into this video, guys. What's going on, everybody? It's the Coffee King here, and today I have another review for you guys. It's going to be by Private Selection, and it's Espresso Roast. I believe this is a dark roast coffee, but I'm super pumped to get into it. You guys already know when it comes to Espresso Roast Coffee, Dark Roast, French Roast. I love it, and I honestly think that this is going to be a good coffee. So without no further ado, let's just jump right into it. All right, guys, so here we are. This is part one of the review. And before I jump into it, you already know what I'm going to be asking you. Make sure that you subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell icon once for your boy. Like my videos, comment on them, share them on the other social media platforms. As of right now, I can do community posts. So if you guys go to my channel and hit community and you see... Me getting ready to drop a video on November 12th because I will be dropping a video November 12th. Make sure that you guys share that. Make sure that you guys share that community post for me. And make sure that you turn on the notification for that as well. Because November 12th at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time here in Ohio, I have a review dropping. And this one's going to be dropping sometime after that. So, um, like I said, part one of the review... Private selection, espresso roast, no cream, no sugar. We got it going in the hustle cup right now, man. Keep grinding out here, guys. Cheers. Part one of the review. <clears throat> it's fairly early this morning, guys, so this is my first cup of the day. And that hit me. That was that was a that was literally a swift roundhouse kick to my taste buds. Sorry if I couldn't find the words there. Oh yeah. It's got that intensity of the espresso. It's a dark roast. It's, you can definitely tell it's a dark roast coffee. Um it's got that it's got the bitterness that I'm looking for. And I love that. And that's the espresso roast that's coming through on that. It's definitely full bodied, rich. It does have a nutty aftertaste, which you know you'll get that in some of your espresso roast coffee. It goes down fairly smooth for me. Now, for the people out there that's wondering, you know, Hey, you know, maybe I should just give that a try. If you have not had espresso or dark roast, any type of dark roast coffee or French roast, do not do it right away. You have to work yourself up to it. There's levels to it. I've been doing this for a long time. And, you know, espresso, French roast, dark roast is my favorite coffees now. Okay, so recap of what I just said. It's full body. It's got a nutty aftertaste to it. It's a rich coffee. It goes down fairly smooth for me. The intensity from the espresso roast is there. You can taste the dark roast and the espresso as well. Um, this is a really solid cup of coffee for the morning. It really is. So with that being said, private selection. For part one of the review on your espresso roast, heavy five out of five all day, baby. You guys are out here killing it. Um, I would absolutely drink this again. Now, this is just part one of the review, but I would absolutely drink this again just the way that it is. So let's jump into part two of the review. Man, this is so good. All right. 
So here we are, part two of the review, private selection espresso roast with one sugar booger and a little bit of that half and half creamer. You already know what it is, guys. Cheers. <sighs> Coffee is life, guys. Coffee is life. I mean, obviously, it's what you make of it. But I'm telling you, me, coffee is life. This is what makes my day. <clears throat> and my family. Can't, can't, I mean, can't miss out on that. The good man, the good Lord above, my family, coffee. That's what makes life for me. Anyways, let's go ahead and jump into this. Um... It's still got that espresso taste to it, the dark roast taste to it. It's pretty heavy still, even though I added sugar and cream to it. Now, sugar's going to sweeten it up like I always say. Creamer's going to lighten it up. You're still going to get the same great flavors in this. Some's going to be dumbed down a little bit, like the nuttiness flavor in this. It's, it's a little dumbed down, but I can still taste it. And it's not bad because, honestly, I would rather it be dumbed down in this coffee. I just like the, you know, espresso dark roast taste. Um, it's still got that full, full body richness to it. And it goes down even more smooth now. Guys, this is pretty much a perfect cup of coffee, if you were wondering. So, do I suggest you guys to try this? Absolutely. But only if you guys have worked your way up to the espresso roast or espresso blend, dark roast, French roast. Only if you guys have worked your way up to that. Now, if you have been drinking light roast coffee, since you've been drinking coffee, please work your way up to this. Don't just rush into it because I'm telling you, you're going to have problems if you do. But um, for part two of the review... You guys already know what it is. Heavy five out of five all day. Make sure that you guys continue to support me. Subscribe to my channel. Please do that. Because that keeps me busting out these reviews for you guys. And the holidays are coming up. So I'm going to have Christmas holiday reviews for you as well. So I'm going to go ahead and jump off of here. Finish this nice cup of coffee. You guys enjoy your day or night. Depending where you guys are from. And keep it fresh. Keep grinding out here. Be successful, love one another, be there for one another, find God, and learn to love yourself more. It's the Coffee King, baby. Peace. And I'll know his secret name and tell him